Thank you. Back to our top story. The final suspect charged in the death of a 10 year old girl learned his fate this morning. Demaya Izel died when someone shot into her uncle's car back in 2022. Our Michael Sandlin joins us live right now. Michael, what sentence did the judge deliver for Diario Cornelius? Amanda Cornelius will now be facing life in prison, receiving the sentence nearly two years to the day after the drive by shooting that killed Azell over on Door Street back in February 9th of 2022. Now, the state believes that Cornelius was the driver in this shooting and that his accomplice, Byron Cleveland, was the shooter. The state believes the pair were trying to kill Azell's uncle, Kenneth White, over a beef waiting outside his home, following him onto Door Street and spraying 11 bullets into his car. But instead, they only injured White and killed his niece instead, sparking shock and outrage in the Toledo community. Now, in the years following, Cleveland has already been sentenced and is serving 39 to 44 years in prison. Today in the courtroom, after Cornelius received his sentence, Judge Stacy Cook asked everyone in the courtroom, regardless of affiliation, to stop the violence. Now, Cornelius was charged six different times, and some of those charges were elevated due to his gang affiliation. Meanwhile, we tried to reach out to Demaya Ezel's family, who were present in the courtroom today. However, their lawyer made clear they're not ready to comment at this time. Reporting in downtown Toledo, I'm Michael Sandlin for WTOL.